Welcome to Goodbit. I'm Maverick and I've got a question for you. Do you own cryptocurrency? Because if you do, you're probably using a wallet, whether you know it or not. If you don't own cryptocurrency, then you still probably have a wallet, just a, a different kind of wallet. I'll explain. Today, we're gonna dive into the wonderful world of wallets. In this video, you'll learn how a blockchain account works, what a wallet is, and how to keep your cryptocurrency as safe as possible. Let's start at the beginning. At first, there was nothing. Infinite darkness, and then rapid expansion called the Big Bang. Dude, shut up. Okay, maybe not that far back. We're talking the beginning of cryptocurrency and blockchain, but in order to send and receive cryptocurrency, you need a blockchain account. Behind the scenes, it's actually pretty complex, but for the most part, it just kind of works like your email account. You have an email address. Let's say ponies are cute with sprinkles33 at gmail.com, and that's your email address, and, and we all know that, and that's all you need for people to send emails to you. Why you chose it, I don't know, but uh, maybe you're just into horses in sixth grade, and that's okay, mom. The cryptocurrency version of your email address is called your public key, or more commonly, public address. Your public address is a long, random string of numbers and letters, and it's where people could send you cryptocurrency. Though they look different, your public address works just like your email address. Simple. But there's another part to your email account. Your password. That's right, your incredibly hack-resistant, indecipherable password that's definitely not password123. Now, before you could send anyone an email with your email account, you first gotta log in with your password. If someone got access to that password, they could just send emails off your account willy-nilly. It's extremely important to keep your password safe. The cryptocurrency version of your password is called your private key. And just like your public address, it's a long, random string of numbers and letters. Your private key allows you to send funds from your public address. It should be kept safe at all times because it is what allows you to control your funds. Only you should have access to your private key, which is why it's called a private key and not a tell everyone key. To recap, your email account has two parts, an email address and a password. Your blockchain account has two parts, a public address and a private key. So what then is a wallet? In everyday life, your wallet is something where you keep your credit card, a college ID, a business card from, and cash. In the cryptocurrency realm, a wallet is actually a piece of software or a hardware device that stores your private key for you and it makes it really easy to send and receive crypto. Instead of memorizing your long, hibberish, dibberish, gibberish private key, your wallet does all that mumbo humbo jumbo for you. The security of your wallet is essentially the security of your private key. And the security of your private key is essentially the security of your cryptocurrency. So, important point, the security of your wallet is the security of your money. As a cryptocurrency user, you have a lot of different wallet options. Some are more convenient, some are free, some cost money, some are safer, and so on. If you already own cryptocurrency and aren't familiar with wallets, you might be wondering why you haven't had to deal with this whole wallet thing. Didn't we just say that wallets are super important? Well, when you make an account on a cryptocurrency exchange, the exchange makes a wallet for you on their servers. Having your money on an exchange account is easy, but these exchanges have been hacked in the past. It's safest if you move your funds away from the exchange account onto a wallet that only you have control over. There are many different types of cryptocurrency wallets that you could choose from, including desktop applications, phone applications, and even USB stick looking thingies. Which one you pick will depend on how much cryptocurrency you're storing and how often you plan on using it. Head over to our types of wallets page to get an overview of your options. Then check out our find a wallet tool to choose the right wallet for you. Let's review. A cryptocurrency wallet is a piece of software or a hardware device that allows you to easily store, send, and receive cryptocurrency. It's extremely important that you keep your wallet secure. 
That's why we recommend you to take your funds and send them from your exchange account into a wallet that only you control. Truth is, there are a lot of hackers and scammers out there and people have lost all of their money simply because they didn't store their cryptocurrency properly. This is part of the reason why we created GoodBit in the first place. We hope our tools and guides help you keep your investments safe. Stay smart and keep your crypto secure. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.